Hi, and welcome to All of Our Friends Are Dead. Yay! And joining me is Voidburger. Woo! <laughs> <laughs> it's a lot of hype for a lot of nothing happening in the title screen. Woo! <laughs> <laughs> what is this? It's, it's a little it's indie like, game. It looks weird. It, it's, it's like a Tron snow globe. Oh, man. There's supposed it's, to be audio? I think or? if Tron looked like this. No, the title screen doesn't have anything. And then there's poetry randomly sprinkled everywhere. I, I didn't get to read that. <laughs> I didn't either when I was playing. People are going to have to pause if they're going to want to read that. But um, So you're a cat. With a gun. cats. No, I was shooting barrels inside of the water, but the water kills you. But there's a family of cats there. Just want to point this that is, out. This is a horror game? <laughs> It looks pretty inoffensive right now, but I don't know. I feel it's kind of creepy. Creepy is subjective, right? Yeah, that's true. I mean, some people are scared of people without faces. That guy didn't have a face. He wasn't very scary. This music, I guess if you can call it music, is pretty scary. I guess it's kind of industrial chip tune -y. It's like what, uh, what would happen if somebody made a cover of a Simon Hill song, I suppose. Hmm. Um, but yeah, there's Vrr, some... Rear, rear, rear. It's like if <laughs> my vacuum got stuck on like a string or something. <laughs> and somebody decided to make it a soundtrack. Mm-hmm. Um, okay. so there's Was some there arachno like a point squid. to this game? Or? Um, you go right, and <laughs> that's pretty much it. And there's a lot of weird text all over the place. Falling, falling, falling. Ah. Uh. And then you fall. Out of a bunch of hits. <laughs> So, there's a lot okay. of blood, I guess, in this game? I'm not sure. I thought it was, like, Kool-Aid. Right? It's not the right color. It's, like, pink. Pinky, magenta, delicious. Raspberry flavored. Even then, video games are weird sometimes. I mean, you wouldn't die if you, like, jumped in a pool of blood, would you? Like, normally? Depends how much you're scared of blood. Oh, you like, had, like, a you panic die attack a... and died because of it? I guess you would drown. Maybe. But yeah, if you touch a family of cats, they disappear. I don't know if that means anything. I feel like this would be a lot scarier if there weren't cats in it. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, uh, the, cats the game has a sequel that doesn't have cats in it. And it would be a lot scarier if <laughs> this jump weren't just a bunch of enemies jumping in from where you can't see. And the enemies like weren't arachno squids. I feel like it'd be scarier if you didn't have a really, really powerful automatic weapon. I'm not and you weren't a cat with a very powerful automatic weapon. <laughs> <laughs> well, yeah, probably. Is there any reason not to just hold the button the whole time? Oh, you did. <laughs> there isn't, except for the fact that my mouse is kind of broken, so I need to actually let go of the button and uh, re-click to move. So I guess also, the scariness is <laughs> that my setup sucks to play mouse games. Mouse-based weaponry. But, um... You pretty much just start off at the beginning of every cutscene, stage, whatever, every time you die. There's a built-in so, save feature anyway, like you could press F5 and F6 to load, and I'll remember to do that eventually. So is there like a point to touching those cat families, or is that like No, it's, it's all ambiance, I guess. You cannot touch them, I suppose. God, I'm gonna have a seizure soon. What is <laughs> there? Is there a lot between of the between like the blood streaks in the background and the snow and the bullets and just a lot of visual garbage here? Yeah, yeah, there is. Wow. It happens a lot. Though. Wow. That's like the cat overlord going meow. I'm not sure what noise I would expect a squid with eight eyes to make. To be honest. They're kind of funny. They're not threatening looking, really. <laughs> they look pretty cute, those squids. Yeah, squids with eight eyes. Um, jumping You're around all right over the place. not going right anymore! <laughs> I thought this game was about going right. You went left. Well, yeah, but then I saw those things and I decided that I had to go back there. And... Oh, shit. Trying to remember how to platform with a keyboard, I think. I don't... <laughs> I have no idea what's going on here. See, that's the only... Uh, that's the only impediment I find to horror games that are made platformers. The controls always, like, 
There, there, there shouldn't be horror games that are platformers. <laughs> uh, there's a lot, though. God, this is like... Some, like, 15-year-old who thought they were really cool did this game. Put their poetry in it. I haven't checked what Amon 26's age was during this, but... I might Probably have not 26. This. I might have... <laughs> I might have played this when I was um, 15, so maybe that's why I'm, my nostalgia is twisting this into, oh, this was kind of there, creepy. There's, there's no excuse for this unless he's 15. If he's 15, <laughs> I forgive him entirely. Uh, if he's 16, I hate him. <laughs> well, he's not 16 anymore. Well, if he was 16 when he made this. I have no idea. I could check. What? But here's a weird thing. Um, we have to jump into it. I don't know what Seems it is. like the natural course of events. <laughs> Just jumping into a shiny thing you find? Jumping into it. What are those pandas? Uh, I think they're cat Cutting people their wrists? with what the hell? straight jackets, but they're bleeding out of their mouths, I guess? Can't even. I can't Another even disappearing see family. You can't destroy every barrel for some reason. <laughs> those things are like the, the end of uh, Super Mario 2 or whatever. I guess so. After you fight Birdo, you go into that, like, like eagle mouth. <laughs> uh, that would... I guess that would be creepier if it came to life and attack you. What? <laughs> I don't... I can't tell if you were doing that for the song, or if you were doing that for this giant squid thing. <laughs> they might be one and the same. Anyway, it wow. dies pretty quickly because you have a ridiculously overpowered orange nerf gun. <laughs> His weakness is nerf guns. And then it just has a little pop because I think... Thank goodness. I think all the enemies are just programmed that, oh, something died, have a little pop somewhere on the screen. <laughs> just a little splatter of blood. So you jump into that and then this happens. That was almost actually a musical uh, moment. Impale. <laughs> Yeah, and then there's they add spikes to replace the water. It still does the uh, same thing, except now you have a little oh. animation for when you die. So are you playing the same levels over again, but now there's more stuff in it? No, these or... are different levels. Oh, oh, I thought, the way you said it, I thought it was like, oh, they're adding spikes to things that we've already done or something. No, but we don't see the water again anymore. But, but that wouldn't surprise me, because indie, some, some indie games are lazy as fuck. Nah, I tend to avoid those. I sometimes uh, forget that I might have not had Forgot to avoid that! <laughs> well, I couldn't see far ahead, alright? <laughs> it was a leap of faith. It was, and... <laughs> He's like... <laughs> dots floating. There's so many dots. It's like this kid couldn't think of other graphics. Just like, what about more dots? Why? You already have dots falling. Well, what if there's bigger dots, but they're going from right to left and they're a different color? Mm, yeah. And two more stages from now, there's going to be more dots, but they'll be in the background and getting closer and closer and closer. Well, like I said, I think this might have been the first game he published. So maybe he was just uh, playing with particle effects and this came out. Very likely. <laughs> I'm gonna feel bad if, like, a 12-year-old made this and it's, like, really good for a 12-year-old. Uh, oh, you're gonna do the same thing! Why are you doing that? Just drop down! I forgot, but at what? some point during these recordings I start remembering to actually save and, uh, reload. Uh, not there, obviously. <laughs> the squids don't, are deceptively don't ever effective play, at killing you. I wanna be the guy. <laughs> <laughs> no, I wouldn't, no. Not, not farewell. <laughs> Those, those shrimpy guys are so cute. Oh no! I think it's because they're like such a happy color. I like them. What about the other things that we saw, like those tall squid guys? Nah. <laughs> they're, not, they're not as cute as the little red the squiddy guys. Ah, fair don't enough. Don't jump, just fall. Yeah, I know. No, I... don't jump. <laughs> I remember that Swear. the block was there, and I think I was saving at that point too. <laughs> So I was like, yeah, even if I die, I'm just gonna pop back. You're gonna give me a heart attack. What about sheep? Kill uh, sheep? kill the pig, I think it says over uh. and over. Or pig the kill. <laughs> pig out and kill, I guess. Anyway, here's uh, another thing that we fell down into. I tried <laughs> moving get, there. You just keep getting farted out places. Yep. And this is one of those things that I think I'm gonna have to censor later. 
Yeah, probably. I'm not sure if I should. There's though. like there's like one pixel that's causing you the, the trouble here. So if you just put <laughs> a gray pixel there, just the erase no one will the pixel. Know. Oh, she is not there. All right, thanks. Uh, oh, you weird could read that cat thing. Okay, I couldn't read that. So yeah, Wee-o, oh no, Wee-o. he died. And there's pillars <laughs> with mouths, and then there's cat bees or cat hornets. Aww, you're wand. a monster for killing all these cuties. Look well, at these little guys. <laughs> they're shooting like, things at me though. That guy was just dancing. <laughs> Just going for a little stroll, having a little dance. You had to go and shoot him in the face. Well, he was shooting me first. It's self-defense, even though I'm obviously holding down the trigger on my automatic weapon. I think you're an invader in their peaceful world, and they're just very startled by you. <laughs> and they're startled you're reflexes. You're some sort of freaky cat with a gun. <laughs> I'd be scared. Even though you're a cat wasp, flying around with your mm-hmm. bloody stinger. Mm-hmm. Oh my god, they're adorable! <laughs> Did he mean to make these monsters really cute? Uh, I don't know. I don't know, I have, I have like high standards for monsters though, so maybe I'm just full of shit. But. According to the Amon, uh, to a blog interview that the guy once did, um, the monsters are all inspired by his nightmares? So I guess he had really cute nightmares by your standards. Aw, lucky him. It was as if I slaughtered them, don't you know? I don't, don't know. Don't you know? I don't know. I don't know. Oh yeah, that's it's like on. I just slaughtered them, don't you know? <laughs> he wound. He wound. He wound himself around. Oh, he wound himself. <laughs> <laughs> a burning diamond tree. I don't know if these things are supposed to be from somewhere or if he just made them himself. But anyway, here's another boss that I don't know how to classify. Like. <laughs> The giant Classify it as I'm pretending to write Japanese. <laughs> oh, you think that's what those symbols mean? <laughs> I don't know. This looks like, uh, you know those um, theories they have about the end boss of Earthbound being a fetus? Oh, it's wait. Like is, that, but is it's that like that, thing? but it's a kidney. <laughs> Just the evil kidney at the end of the stage. I once passed the kidney stone. You- you represent a kidney stone, just slaughtering everything in somebody's digestive system, which is filled with cute stuff for some reason. Well, we're getting into less cute stuff, right? I mean, with all this... I don't know, I haven't seen the adorable enemies in this level yet. I bet they're cute as shit. Oh, there's this jittery fellow. Well, he's pretty cute. He's like one of those solar-powered head bobbler things that you have on your dashboard of your car. And it has a key inside, and there's no other way to progress. Oh, there's key mechanics in this, that's new. Yeah, they they added a locked door, and then they ask you if you can offer just one. I guess they ask you if you can offer just one of your friends that aren't dead? Don't you think? Don't you know? Kill all your friends, don't you know? Anyway, here's a leveled up version of the squid thing, I think. Hmm. It's trapped in that place, and it keeps shooting out and moving really quickly, so I'm just gonna kill it from up here like oh a coward. Oh my god, this background is so hideous. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is so ugly. Yeah. Tentacles moving left and moving right, that's not very... <laughs> I guess they could be smoke wasps? Maybe you're in, like, a tentacle factory. And those are just tentacles on uh, conveyor belts going in different directions. Is, is that a thing that people do these days? Tentacle factories? Just mass manufacture? Japan, I don't know. <laughs> oh yeah. Probably a factory somewhere. Probably. Weep, 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 weep. I guess that is disturbing, in the sense that I can't believe this counts as music. Uh, it's just, it's, yeah. Dissonant? There's just so much garbage, and like, visually, and So everything very else. proud. You can read that? How can you read this shit? And to think she was once a mother. I can't read it because I think I stared too long at this. <laughs> hmm. I actually like that drawing. That was actually kind of scary. I suppose it was, but it doesn't make any sense. Like, I'm not sure if Is I'm it? supposed to be afraid of the woman. Am I supposed to be sad that she's dead? Is she dead? Or is she the one Is that's this- telling me? Is that the same woman that we saw hung up earlier? 
prop mouth. I don't know. See, I like that little squid guy. He looks like a blooper. That's yeah, he's like evolved. Had too much, if you he's like had enough, too much caffeine normal. and he's just going crazy. Womp, 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 womp. <laughs> that was almost music. <laughs> I'll give him kudos for that. Almost being music. I think it comes back a couple of times. Womp, 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 womp. So if you get hit by any of those, you probably die, right? Yep. One hit, oh. kill, wonder. Hmm. I don't think you got hit by any of those yet. I think all your deaths have been environmental. <laughs> no, the uh, squid thing it. fell on me once. Oh, that's right. I think it fell on me twice. But it wasn't a projectile. Uh, fair enough. Flum, 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 flum. I think I'm going to die here. Yep. Ooh. <laughs> I jumped too it. high, controlling the height of my jumps. It's not my forte with a keyboard. They keep teasing you at the beginning of a song. Vom, 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 vom. <laughs> but then a song doesn't start. <laughs> Maybe that's a style. It's a denial. Denial song. I want like a backbeat to happen and like some drums. And then there'll be a backtrack. Oh, song. maybe when he was playing, he also had the gun firing all the time. So he figured that would be the backbeat for all the songs. Oh, it's almost a backbeat. If it was less fast, it would be okay. <laughs> <laughs> then it could be a rhythm game. And you will first be rhythm horror one game. Ashes. And then a tentacle. <laughs> <laughs> or lightning. <laughs> So there's things trapped in the sides that we can't get to, and then at the bottom, more spikes. Uh huh. This is the last area. <laughs> Good. <laughs> yeah, you said this was short, but it's not even short enough because <laughs> this music and the visuals are so hideous. Uh, I don't think they get better in the sequel, unfortunately. It's like this could have almost been a good horror game if not for. I guess like, it was maybe good like for five or time. six things. W would you say that this was good for like 2006? No. Nah. <laughs> for so. indie games in 2006, at least. <laughs> uh, if, yeah, but you have to. Add, that's like two things that are bad <laughs> on top of each other, qualifying it. Oh well. As passable. But we can agree it could have been worse. Yes, okay. but that's not that, saying that, too much. That's not saying much, I know. But I, I feel a little guilty about showing <laughs> this off and then being like, ah, man, now I can see all the faults. <laughs> oh, here's, I'm just here's the same it. lady, so except with a sword on a chain. Ding, 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 ding. You can't shoot her heart. Unless you shoot this one. That's deep, man. It's deep. Is it? Because you just go shoot that other thing and then you can shoot it's, the heart. But, man, that's like, whoa. <laughs> whoa. Try to humor the game a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, so, man. why is she dead? Or is she... I don't... I have no idea. Is this the same the, girl? The plot I isn't don't... clear in this thing. It's like, is there a plot or is it just some kid's poetry book? It might be some kid's poetry book. I'm wondering. Fucka 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 fucka. <laughs> and the heart doesn't make a less ridiculous oh sound God. either. It's like the world's most... I mean, it's nightmarish in that the audio is absolutely the worst thing ever. <laughs> like, I can't wait to get out of this game so this, I don't have to This one to chord it. has been happening this entire level and I'm going insane. <laughs> This one chord. Wow. Oh, uh, there we go. Bye, baby. And the audio stops, sort of. Thank you for releasing me from audio hell. <laughs> well, that's pretty much it. I just go back and show off that the box stays there for some reason, even though there's no heart to protect. Couldn't be fucked to program it out. <laughs> Maybe. And then more poetry. N ruin? Yeah, I don't know what that means either. I thought it might have been old English or something, like stylistic. Maybe he there was a space bar he didn't mean to hit there. Maybe. But then there's phrases like listen at us. Share us share with us your head. Do hide behind the iris. Is English his first language? Uh I don't know. I think it's it that guy be. I think it that might keeps be. eating us. 
Oh, 2009. 2009. Whoops. No excuse. <laughs> For some reason. Uh, Unless he's 15. Then it's okay. Unless then, he was job. 15 at th- in 2009. Should we check before we finish recording so that we can confirm? No. 